ketogenic diet, some people say the ketogenic diet is not magical. The ketogenic diet does nothing magical. In the context of body composition alterations or fat loss, that could be, there's truth to that. However, I, I, I say there's a hard stop there. The ketogenic diet is indeed a magical diet in the way that uh, it remarkably changes our physiology. And there's no other diet uh, that exists that can, for example, manage drug-resistant seizures. And it does that because it profoundly changes our fuel system, our physiology, our biochemistry, and our neuropharmacology. And that's why it's such a fruitful, robust area of research right now with drug companies scrambling to mimic the ketogenic If we had a drug that would mim mimic the ketogenic diet, it would be a, a blockbuster drug. Um, if you take patients, if you took 100 patients who are drug resistant, so they're having nonstop seizures despite all the best available pharmacology, my recollection, this could be incorrect mm -hmm. and you can update this, is that um, a ketogenic diet will completely cure one third of them, will cause about a 50% reduction in seizure activity for another third of them, while one third of them will still be unresponsive. Is that still directionally correct? Yeah, in the context of pediatric epilepsy, about two thirds will be, so it's that high. Two thirds will be? Two thirds will be uh, therapeutic, therapeutically responsive uh, right. to a ketogenic diet therapy for managing seizures, are, are highly efficacious for managing seizures. Two thirds of people who have failed drug therapy, and not we're not just talking about one drug, we're yep. talking about polypharmacy, adding multiple drugs, like, you know, uh, the list goes on. Uh, so in adults, it's more about closer to post-adolescence, about 30 to 40 percent. Uh, but then it's thought that at adherence and compliance, right, 